that was uh, Rosie Abbott with Hard to Sleep. Um, and uh, I have uh, Rosie uh, with me in the studio now. How Hello. you doing, Rosie? Okay. Um, good, thank you. Yeah. Excellent, good stuff. Uh, also, of course, um, as always, uh, got uh, got Danny Scarborough as well. Shout hello, hello Danny, because you got a mic. Yeah. <laughs> Only one mic. Yeah, just just to, to explain, we're, uh, we've we've decided just to uh, move out of the Trent Sound Hot Lounge, and it's got nothing to do with uh, with mine and my, uh, my 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 absent co-host's incompetence. We're in the um, cupboard. We're, we are in the cupboard. Yeah, we're we're in the hot cupboard. <laughs> That actually sounds a bit wrong, doesn't it, to be <laughs> fair? Um, yeah, we're, we're, we're in Studio One. That sounds far more professional, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. We're, we're live from Studio One tonight. Um, and, uh, and we've got Rosie and, uh, and Danny with us, as I've, al- as I've already said. And uh, you, well, you, you're in mainly, I guess, to, to talk about your new album that's, uh, that's yes, coming out. Yes, new yeah. album came out last Friday. Yeah. Um, and uh, it's, it's called Rosie Abbott. You know, my name just thought it'd be a nice, easy name to use. Uh-huh. Uh, <laughs> easy to remember. Yeah, of um, course. So yeah, it's available now on my uh, website and CD Baby. Right. Um, okay. Cool. Yeah. Brilliant. Which I'll probably say more about in a bit. Yeah. <laughs> definitely. Yeah. Absolutely. It's uh, well. We're um, well. I, we've we know you here at yeah. Knots Live well enough because you've uh, you've been on the show um, previously. We, I've had a name change since then. Of course. You, well, you have. Yeah. yeah. Last I time w- I was on, I was Rosie Rojo. Yeah. What. what what happened with that then? Oh yeah. What was that all about? D- d- messy divorce. Oh, was it? Yeah. No, yeah. no. I just <laughs> I changed. Um, well, Rosie Abbott's my real name, obviously. Yeah. Uh, the Rojo thing. I didn't realise when I chose that name that uh, Rojo means Spanish in red or rojo or whatever how you pronounce it. Because I don't right. speak Spanish. Okay. And people kept saying, oh, "What's the Spanish connection and, and stuff?" Yeah. Yeah. And I, I had to keep saying, I don't know. <laughs> so no, I'm not Spanish. I'm not Spanish and no. all that. So I just sort of clear it up and just go with my real name. Right, OK. <laughs> so you've uh, you've done that, moved on to your, to your real name. Yeah. And uh, also um, the, the name of your, your album, basically, that's isn't right, it? Yeah. yeah, you've kept kept it nice and simple. Eponymous, simulated. I think, is the fancy Eponymous, word. yeah, that's the one, yeah. That would be the one Andy would use if he was here. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I just say, you've called it after yourself. Well, that's what I was going <laughs> to yeah. say, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, but t- tell us a little bit... Um, about you, you thought yourself, you, you, your history, I suppose, and, and, and playing. I mean, I know we've gone over this yeah. on Knots Live, but uh, we're hoping to expose you to uh, to a whole new audience, new audience yeah. tonight. So, well, how long have you been playing for, first of all? Playing, uh, well, I've been writing songs since I was about twelve. Right. Um, and playing live, I'd say it's probably. I mean, Danny were in a band together. Right. Sort of. Was it about six years ago? Seven years ago? Ten Longer? Right. Ten years ago? Ten years ago. <laughs> wow. Time's gone quick. Yeah. Um, and during that time since then, I've just been writing and writing and writing and uh, f- recording mm. stuff. Um, and you're here on the album. It's like w- what we're doing today, playing acoustically. It's not what I sound like yeah. on the album. It's a lot more multi-layered. It is, yeah. Pianos and strings and everything. Yeah, because um, you, you've, you, well, you, you've been described, um, I, I suppose, I was going to say experimentals. Uh, a bit of a lazy description but I can't yeah. think of any other way to sort of describe what you do because it is you, you, you're not afraid to sort of chuck new sounds in there no. try new things and, and um, that's yeah that's right really. um, just go with the mood I'm in at the time and whatever mood I'm in that's kind of the song comes out of that and yeah don't argue with it <laughs> well, well that's it um, but uh, for, I suppose well you said you've you know, played, it, played a good number of years you've, yeah, you, yeah. You, you, you still play your first guitar I'm right in saying as well don't you yeah well actually yeah. Danny's going to be playing I'm, it tonight because Danny's, Danny's she, got a, she, yeah. She, yeah, I've yeah. given my permission. Not many people get to hold. Uh, Millie is her Millie. name. She yeah. has a name and everything. But wow. yeah, she just had celebrated her tenth birthday. Actually. Wow. Yeah, as you can see, well, people listening yeah. can't see. She's she's covered in in uh, scratches. And yeah, she's <laughs> so she's looking uh, well loved. Well used and well loved. Yeah, yeah absolutely. And abused. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> used and abused. <laughs> used and abused. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I can think of a slightly better way. Than it, but uh, hey, you know, who, who knows what goes on? Um, but yeah, uh, I think what we should do. Um, is get a completely um, not non-representative example of, uh, mm. of what your album sounds like. Yeah, good <laughs> idea. But um, excellent, albeit. Um, what are you going to play for us first? Um, we're going to play a song called Wood Pigeon Translation. Okay. Which would normally have a wood pigeon doing backing vocals, but he couldn't make it tonight. He was working late. So right. you just have to imagine the pigeon. Okay, take it away. I'll fill in for him. Might need you 
Charles the Abbot there with the uh, Wood Pigeon translation. Um, that's um, that's that's one of my uh, one of my six year old daughter's personal favourites. That <laughs> one actually, um, and she'll be uh, she'll be absolutely ecstatic. You've done oh, that. Oh, good. I good, really good. am as well. I've, I've, <laughs> I was wondering when you know obviously. Um, when you when you said you were going to play that one, yeah. I thought that's going to be interesting about <laughs> wood pigeon. But yeah. uh, you your your wood pigeon mimicking skills are well. Are I'm fluent in, in wood pigeon, of course, because I, I wouldn't have been able to write the song otherwise. Of course. So. Yeah. And if you go on my website, actually, www.rosieabbott.co.uk, there's a little button on the bottom, and it's the uh, wood pigeon translator. So you can actually, if you don't speak wood pigeon. Mm-hmm press the button it gives you a full english translation ah yeah. awesome that's so. really good yeah i was uh, i was gonna get onto your website because yeah. it's um yeah i've, I've been uh, having having a bit of a look at it myself over <laughs> the last few days or so and there's uh, it's um well I, th- I, th- I think we can we can say with with rosie abbott no- nothing's quite 100 <laughs> yeah. percent conventional is it and uh, no. it's not what you'd expect um to find on the on, on your average musician's <laughs> website, really. Um, wow. Yeah, you've got um, you've got a couple of a uh, couple of different pages, haven't you? You've got there's, yes, I mean, there's the main the main page with yeah. all the uh, the uh, boring rosy stuff. But like, mm-hmm. if you go if, if you click, there's a little mouse hole, which I don't know whether many people have found yet. If you click on that, you go into like the Rosie Abbott secret realm of uh, and the, mm-hmm. there's like this radio show. Mm-hmm. Um, there's also a special page for my friend Greg. Yeah. Um, who, who, who would really appreciate it if people actually like looked at it because he's getting a bit he's sort of insecure about it. Is he getting a little bit? Yeah, oh, he keeps saying, why aren't people Why aren't people looked on your page? Yeah. 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 Well, I, you, I, well, I strongly recommend everybody does that. <laughs> and I, I do, I must admit, I like, an, I like on a website that you have to make a particular amount of effort to find uh, these secret little things yeah. as well. So, yeah. I tried you, to make it obvious, but it's yeah. not obvious no. enough. But well, well, it took me months to build. Look right. out for the mouse hole. It, it's fantastic. And uh, while well, I was saying to you off air, uh, I was spending some time um, listening to the radio show mm-hmm. that's on there. And uh, frankly, it made me feel like giving up because it's, it's about <laughs> 10 times better than, than no, any efforts no, I can no, do. No. So, <laughs> but it's, um, th- that, that is, um, to any, anyone listening, is well, well worth a listen. I, I guess that took a fair old amount of time to put together, though, did it? It did. Well, about a week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Because um, <laughs> uh, it was the main problem was doing all the different voices. Because obviously there's uh, male, female, uh-huh. animal, all, you know, like different yeah. things, and I had to kind of just like pitch shift the voices for the, for yeah. the male voices, and then record that, change that, then do the other voice. And it was just like mm. quite a quite a mission, but it was good yeah. fun. And you, and you voice you voice the whole radio show as well, do you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool. I'm Jam D- DJ Jammy Jims. Oh, I like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I also have a beard uh, in the yeah, picture as yeah. well, which people have commented on that I look good in one, so I'm going to try and grow one yeah. if you're in real life. Uh, yeah, oh, wow. that'd, be, that'd be good. I've, I've, I've seen pictures you before in the moustache, which I found, thought the was very, very, very well. fetching. Yeah, I was yeah. trying to get that as like the new fashion for women. Yeah, I, I like it. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. I, I thought I thought you looked absolutely, you know, absolutely <laughs> gorgeous with a moustache. I did, which, which, uh, which was causing me severe problems. Yeah, I'm totally honest I know with I messed you. up a lot of yeah, people's yeah, sort of yeah, heads yeah, there. So, yeah. Certain, um, yeah, c- confusion on, uh, <laughs> on on gender identity there, basically. Yeah. But yeah, um, uh, there's a story behind that moustache actually, because we were, it was uh, we had a barbecue last Easter, right? And um, we decided we were going to originally I wanted to go to the fancy dress shop and buy like a rabbit costume, chick mm-hmm. costume and stuff, but we got there and they're so expensive, and the only thing we could afford was it was a moustache right so <laughs> we, we got one each yeah and um had the barbecue with a moustache but eating burgers with a moustache on i feel I've, I've got a new kind of understanding you know i can, I can yeah guys with facial hair how what they go through yeah i've, I've, I've never thought of growing a must, moustache well i have considered it in the past but then yeah the, the idea of having half my dinner stuck in it mm. did, did sort of put me off they, to be they fair, frightened but me quite a bit. yeah to yeah. be honest so yeah M- moustaches on girls is the future, it's the future. maybe we'll s- yeah <laughs> um yeah uh, what on earth do you follow that wax, with waxing oh well your top lip. yeah waxing, waxing your top, your top lip, lip. And, and all men should go out and wax the top lips yeah. from here on him yeah yeah we, is that what we're saying that should should work the other way around really shouldn't yeah. it yeah 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 okay in in the uh in the um United Republic of, uh, of Rosie Abbott. <laughs> that, those were the first two decrees. All that's, women must grow moustaches and all men must wax thing, yeah. their top lips. Not allowed in otherwise. Fantastic, yeah. brilliant. And uh, yeah, you, you sort of... Um, we wanted to talk a, a little bit more about the album because we touched on it yeah. and you explained sort of, you know, it, it's out there. Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, yeah, the, well, the whole thing is really sort of... Uh, a joy to behold, really. And ben is holding it right now, I, by the I way. I am, yeah. <laughs> He's I beholding am it. holding it, yeah. And uh, yeah, it's again one of the reasons where it. I, I sometimes sort of 
bemoan the death of the the, the mm. physical the physical sort of uh, CD really. Well, um, that's why I wanted to have the option. I've got yeah. a download option as well if you if you want that. Mm-hmm. But um, I much prefer having the physical yeah, disc I itself. Agree yeah. with that. And there's 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 two pictures of you. Right? Mm-hmm. One on the front, one on the back. Um, and this one of you on the back I'm guessing about three maybe <laughs> two I think two the, the portrait on the front mm-hmm. was done by my sister Caroline yeah. uh-huh. um, who stood next to me filming all this <laughs> yeah say hello Caroline no, no she doesn't <laughs> speak she's a mute so, oh she's right. a mute yeah. right yeah. <laughs> and um, the one on the back was done yeah. by my granddad when wow. I was about two so so shows a I just liked having the two different eras of yeah, that's portraits. Cool. You know, not many people can say they've had their portrait done. So I just no, I'm lucky that I live with an artist. An artist, <laughs> yeah, and, and shows us definitely a, a a family artistic provenance as yeah, well. Yeah, I clearly. guess so. And yeah. my granddad played piano, so and the wood pigeon idea and everything came from him. But oh. probably when we were kids and he used to sort of we'd hear the pigeon in the garden and he'd tell us what it was saying right yeah oh okay uh, so <laughs> which we completely you know obviously we believed it yeah. we kids, so wow so so that originated there really oh so it's, it, it's been sort of um yeah. in, in the depths of your mind yeah. For, yeah. for many years basically mm. wow, that's cool and i know it's on the track listing obviously um having um sort of uh, had the pleasure of getting your your first kind of well it wasn't really released it was wasn't it? No, no it was just sort of a promotional a bit of a promo thing, thing yeah, yeah. I, I haven't this is the first official rosie abbott release that people can actually buy you know like yeah. for ages years people have been saying where can i where can i get your music where can i buy it when i'm like yeah um, you can't you can't <laughs> actually but i'll send you one for free and yeah. i sort of started to realize that i could have made a bit of money but yeah well this uh, is it but uh, hey you know but it, hey, it's, it's not it, what i'm doing it for it's here now but yeah i've been I, I've, I've been listening to your stuff uh, almost constantly for the last year because oh. I don't, don't know if you recall uh, the, the first copy of yes. your EP sent me got stuck in my car stereo. I know and you're yeah. forced to listen that, to it every day that, like, that's, okay. it, that's, that's the I'm thing really I think my music it grows on people yeah, yeah that's why I'm such a big it fan it takes now. a long what, time to get into what well, you should not that do long, but, you know. is make your album that little bit extra thick so it gets Just so stuck it gets in everybody's wedged. car stereo well that's what yeah. I was thinking when I had it professionally done and like the, the CD for this one it's actually you know properly printed but yeah. the ones I gave out my old ones that I used to make myself I used to stick you did. which yeah. destroyed loads of people's CD players it did. cars yeah. and just yeah. computers broke and mm. everything yeah I think I, th- I think you broke my car that was stereo. my plan yeah. so people could I, would listen to it and have that's it yeah you bro- broke my car stereo and um, <laughs> the, the old Sherwood Radio's playlist computer yeah, yeah. I, did, I remember in, that in, well in, yeah. two, in two days that was brilliant yeah, yeah. Know, a, an achievement me. and uh, therefore it etched you on my memory forever <laughs> for whatever reason that is yeah, um, yeah but I was I was going to say what, Sorry. What, what seems yeah. like about ten years ago now <laughs> <laughs> um, there is a mixture of tracks there, sort yeah. of old and old and new. Um, I guess because mm. the first one wasn't ever officially released, no. and they're going to be new to most people. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Um, um, I noticed obviously with uh, "Hard to Sleep," for example, it's, yeah. a, it's a, a re-recording. Is that re-recorded the vocals and remixed yeah. the strings? Because originally, when I did that song, it was like so quick I mm. was literally like wrote it and recorded it in the same day or something and it, yeah. it was only ever supposed to be a demo you know right. the first version of it but sure. I liked the uh, the sound of the guitars and the strings and everything I didn't want to change that too much but mm. I felt after playing it live so much I'd got to f- more familiar with I felt more comfortable with the vocal and right uh, I get you did it uh, so again <laughs> yeah so that so that are, th- are they all re-records all the old no. ones or some some of them you've just i you've recorded just sort of transferred straight basically across? all of them were recorded all of them bar two mm. were recorded last uh no recorded in 2010 right. um in a week like okay. um so the only two that i did since then were wood pigeon and hard to sleep right okay so, and and um <laughs> and all, all self-recorded as uh, all self-recorded as, 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 as you usual do, you? yeah i did it Still, was Still on your little eight track. Little eight track, yeah. yes. Cool. Yeah, because uh, I, I recorded it all. My parents were on holiday in Australia, and I, I took all my stuff to their house. And mm-hmm. they're away for four weeks. And the first three weeks, I just kind of sat around eating biscuits and things. And then I thought, oh, hang yeah. on, they're coming back in a week. I better record the album. So I just got yeah, on with it. Gone Didn't with it. sleep. Yeah. Like, <laughs> just, just, <laughs> just did it all. Played the violin on it as, uh, on the recording as well. And oh, a lot right. of them there, which was a okay. learning curve. 
Yeah, you, you, you're string a, quartet, an, an avid violin player. Then are you? Or? I did have, I did used to play violin a long time ago at primary school, but I was never yeah. very good. But yeah. um, I sort of accidentally forgot to give them their violin back. Ah, but that's, that's fine. Okay. Fair enough. I'm taking good care of it. Yeah, well, that's it. You're looking after it. And it's being put to good use, yeah. and uh, pro- probably better than a than a ten year old could, exactly. could, could use yeah. it. So, yeah. and it sounds really good as well. Yeah, that, that, that's really acceptable. Good. We'll we'll, uh, we'll we'll accept mm. that and let you off for Thank it. Thank you. Um, what, the what? school owes me one anyway. Oh, okay. Really? Can we go into that? No. Oh, okay. Fair Just enough. School. The school owes a one. There <laughs> Just you go. Owes yeah, me one. That's it. <laughs> we'll we'll move on then and uh, <laughs> and, and move on to uh, to another song, shall we? Good idea. Yeah, that yeah. sounds good to me. And what are you gonna what are you gonna play for us next? Uh, this one's called "If You're Happy and You Don't Know It." Right. Okay. This sort is sort of a twist on the old yeah. standard. Um, and on the album, it's actually piano. Um, right. So we've uh, adapted it again. I'm, I'm sure we could see. have got a piano in this room. Uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> we should have. If I'd known yeah. the space, I would have brought it. Definitely. Yeah, of course. Um, yeah. Uh, um, but anyway, I digress. I digress. Take it away. Okay. your hands Rosie uh, and and Danny there with um, if you're happy and you don't know it, um, D- Danny you, you sat dead quiet in the corner. I know you've not got a mic, but I, f- I feel like we're, ne- we're neglecting you. Yeah, um, that's okay. You're right, mate. 
Yeah. He's also a mute as well. It's fine. He's, oh right. So I you, hang out with mutes. You work on with mutes. Yeah, okay. we work telepathically normally. Actually, no. Danny is brilliant when teaching him songs like that, because I'm rubbish at sort of explaining it, the notes and the technical stuff. So I'll literally I'll just play it, and Danny will work it all out by ear and yeah. picks it up so quickly. He's brilliant. Yeah. It's quite hard to learn that one. Yeah. yeah, quite hard, quite a hard one to learn. Yeah, <laughs> but uh, but yeah, but we've been like playing together for it's like ten years, haven't we? Really, so we we know how each other, you know, we know mm -hmm. sort of in tune in that way. Yeah. But he's a brilliant guitarist, yeah. I must say go. so, and yeah, bass player in the Evil Tones, of course. He, he is indeed, yeah, in in the Evil Tones. Um, to 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 which we're we're going to kind of move on to in a, in, ah. in a, in a second because uh, we're going to give you a, a little break um, yeah. while we. Uh, play a couple of songs uh, that, that you've you've actually selected for us uh, yes, today yeah cool. and um you've well two of which um wh one of which is a is an evil tones track smoke and mirrors that's uh, right which i believe we've played once before but i played the wrong one <laughs> am, I, am i right in saying danny what, what was it smoke and mirrors no, that uh, was the right one i think it was it was the evil tones which we had the, an old version of that track uh, that's right an old version of, of <laughs> the evil tones wasn't it yes yeah. yeah yeah i remember now yeah um anyway but less less said about that the better i think to be honest um, <laughs> but yeah so you, you've picked uh, an evil tones track with smoke and mirrors that, that one particularly for i just reason? think it's a really good song yeah i uh, just it's catchy it gets stuck in my head all the time okay um but the album's great as well you yeah. should definitely listen to the album and, yeah. and they're brilliant live as well yeah really good I, I can't i cannot disagree with any of that mm. um, yeah you, you summed it up perfectly and uh, and after that we're going to play um a song by an artist called jonathan beckett jonathan beckett yeah. yeah he's a good friend of mine um he's he released his ep uh must have been was it, i think it was last year yeah. on occultation records um mm -hmm. and the song i picked is the title track off that she's a vampire right um okay. but brilliant singer songwriter yeah. So you also check him out. Yeah, yes. definitely, definitely worth checking out. So um, yeah, well, we're going to play those uh, right now for you. Uh, sure. We're going to start um, with uh, with the evil tones and smoke and mirrors, and uh, after that, we're going to play Jonathan Beckett with "She's a Vampire." That was uh, Jonathan Beckett with uh, "She's a Vampire," and uh, prior to that, we had uh, the evil tones um, featuring uh, one of our artists tonight, Danny Scarborough, with "Smoke and Mirrors," uh, both selections of uh, of Rosie Abbott. Who is still here mm -hmm. with us? Yeah. How are you doing? Okay. I'm g doing fine, thank you. A bit hot, but it's, well, yeah, it's um, in this little cupboard, but yeah. it's, <laughs> it's it's not called the the hot lounge it, for well, nothing, exactly. or the hot cupboard, or or, yeah. or hot studio one, or whatever we're calling it this week. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm, I'm going with Studio One. Studio One sounds better. Sounds better. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, <laughs> we've we've talked at length about the album, really now, but we mm. we haven't talked a deal about where you can actually get this uh, th this yes. publication, um, recording, whatever you want to call it from. Well, there's two ways. They yeah. can either visit my website, www.rosieabbott.co.uk, and if you click on um, store, there's like a menu across the top. Click on store, and then um, you can order it that way. Mm -hmm. uh, it's through PayPal and everything. It's all secure and legitimate and everything. Okay. And then, um, or you can find me on CD Baby. There's a link to it in the store on my website. Okay. Or if you just go onto CD Baby and type in Rosie Abbott on the search bar, um, and I come up you there, come straight so up. you can download the MP3 version there if you like. Cool. Um, yeah. And, uh, yeah, That's I'd really it. appreciate it if you did. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I, I heartily recommend everybody Thank does. You. And uh, you, you, you're a, bit, a little bit quiet on the big front, aren't you, at the moment? But um, yeah, I've not done many that recently. Um, mostly because I was sorting out all the technical stuff of releasing the album and yeah, things. But um, I've got a gig coming up in July in Loughborough mm -hmm. um, at the Priory. Uh, yep. at their live acoustic special that they have every couple of months it's a really good venue yep. really good uh, setup there so i'm looking forward to that excellent and um, we're, well we're, we're hoping to have some uh, rosie abbott trent trent sound related news but uh, we'll, we'll keep that keep that under the hat <laughs> yeah. for the time being uh, involving a, involving a, a live appearance stroke yeah, performance but we'll, we'll keep up keep that one under our hats for a little mm. while um for now but uh, yeah you can uh, you can go on rosie's website which we have a link to on the uh, trent sound website which uh, oh, which you're all on now basically if you're listening <laughs> because you have to be on it in order to listen to it <laughs> um so go, go to the uh, the knots live um program page and you will find a link to to Rosie's website. Uh, you can find Rosie, of course, on um, 
on on Twitter and Facebook as well. Uh, yeah, I'm a new I'm new to the Twitter thing, really. Yeah. Relatively new. Yeah, uh, as am I. Actually. I think we sort of signed up about the same week, didn't we? Yeah, that's it. Um, I, anyone would think I was stalking. <laughs> I'm not. I trust trust me, I'm not. Yeah, I was sort of reluctantly signed up to it, but it's been mm. it's been quite good. Um, I'm still on Facebook. Yeah, the, the, I've got a personal page, but there's also the Rosie Abbott fan page yeah. that anyone's free to have a look at. Sure, and I'm on Reverb Nation as well. You are. How, how yeah. do you how do you <laughs> find the limitations of Twitter as regards your um, your your musings and postings and because yeah. they, they tend to go on to, for more than the hundred and forty uh, odd words or whatever. I it do. Is. I tend to put like the kind of summary version on the yeah the the, the shortened version on Twitter, obviously, because it. Yeah. Oh. Um, but. It's, use, it's it's better for just doing kind of quick reminders of things or putting links up to videos or... Yeah, of course. Um, just staying in touch with, with people and meeting new people. But mm. Facebook's better for if you want to go into more detail. It is, <laughs> uh, yeah. Like describing your sort of dreams and yeah, stuff. Yeah, dreams. Which seem which to do more. <laughs> yeah, which uh, are always uh, amazingly people, interesting pe- More reading. people click that they like my dreams than they like my music, but yeah, that's fine. Well, that's fair enough, yeah. Well, yeah. Perhaps, perhaps Surely your music is they one of your dreams, though. They sort of though, morph you know? together, actually. Yeah, that's it, yeah, they do. I'm, I'm, I'm sure some of the uh, some of the subject matter for your songs come out of things. And a lot of the, yeah, the, the yeah. radio show I did, were bits of that were coming out of, uh, came out of dreams and yeah. things. Yeah, oh, excellent. Okay, Re- really, really interesting stuff. But yeah, get yourself on Rosie's website, buy her, uh, buy her album. Uh, and um, like I say, I, I, I do strongly suggest um, you uh, you go on the... Uh, on Rosie's radio show on her website, and of course go on uh, go on Greg's page. Greg, he's, he's, he's got a guest say. book and everything. He doesn't speak very good English, um, but it, it, yeah, he's learning quite well. He is. He, he does all right on Twitter and Facebook he himself. Does fine. Though, People, he? Me, he can make himself understood. He's basically yeah. friendly and and stuff. Yeah. Excellent. Good. Well, anyway, shall we uh, shall we get one final <laughs> song from you before you go? Yes, sounds good. Okay. Um, what are you going to play for us? This one's called One More Glass, okay. and it's a it's a drinking song. Right. So feel to free to join in with hiccups and whatever. Mm, yeah. Okay. Right. Brilliant. Take it away. I'm in desperate need of some light relief. Things are heavy, baby. So when I get back home from work. To release all the pressure, baby, that's been building up inside of me In need of something to comfort me Baby, I'm in trouble, won't you please go fix me a drink to help me to sleep
That was proper English gentleman with fuel, um, which uh, which came a little bit earlier than I expected, to be honest. Um, but uh, Ruth swears blind it was my fault. That although I'm not not quite sure how that works. But hey, th <laughs> thanks for your, thanks for your technical input, Ruth. Um, no yeah, that's come off their um, Fuel Stroke Monsters EP, which is uh, available on a name your price basis from Proper English Gentleman Bandcamp. .bandcamp.com easy for me to say isn't it um, yeah but I, I thought since we didn't actually sort of say bye properly I didn't get to say goodbye no she, Rose is here um, I'm, I'm now in the um, in the presence uh, in studio too in the presence of a true radio professional been allowed in the fancy studio yeah this is the, this is the one where um, it's like it, a spaceship yeah it, it's pretty cool uh, yeah, I'm having to resist pressing the big red button that yeah, says don't press this button do not press this button I, see do you know what if there was a button that said do not press this button i would have to press it well that's my problem yeah. see how i'm holding back here yeah well i've got to tell you i know from experience that most of these buttons don't do anything because i reckon <laughs> i've pretty much pressed them all uh, just to see if it does anything mm. um but uh, yeah we, we we took the show off the air once though Oh, right. That's when I oh, stopped. That's, that's when I stopped randomly <laughs> pressing buttons. But anyway, I'm, I'm, if, if you hadn't already guessed, I'm still talking to Rosie Abbott, um, and we, I just thought I'd get you in really, so we we make sure that everybody knows where we can uh, mm. get this this wonderful recording of yours from. So let, let, let's go through that again. Through it again. Yeah. Yeah. So the main place, if you want to find out anything about me and all the links to everything, is on my website, which is www.rosieabbott.co.uk. That's uh -huh. Abbott with two T's, by the way. I'm not related related to uh, Russ Abbott. No. Or, or, or Abbott Ale. Or Abbott Ale. Yeah, no. Unfortunately, because otherwise I might be able to wangle some kind of sponsorship. Deal. That that'd be fun, that'd be phenomenal, and, and um, I'd <laughs> I'd be I'd be even more friendly towards you. Then, to <laughs> yeah, be honest, sure you, could get, you could get would. free Abbott Ale. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah, that'd but, be good. Um, no. So there's links to everything on there. But if you basically if you go on the store on the website, and then there's a link to CD Baby. You can buy the download, or you can buy the um, the actual physical CD, which I recommend because it's got brilliant artwork by I my do. sister. Yeah, it's cool. It's brilliant. I really, really like it. But yeah, that's that's where you can get this um, this album from. Thank and uh, of course, uh, look out for for Rosie on uh, on on Twitter, on Twitter. and uh, Facebook mm -hmm. because uh, her her posts are very, very entertaining, <laughs> thought provoking, and sometimes completely bamboozling. Yeah, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a fair to say. That yeah, sums yeah. me up. Yeah. Okay, well, <laughs> that, that was it, really. Just uh, again, thank you for coming in. Well, thanks and, for having uh, me. It's okay. it's been a real pleasure. Thank you. Thank you very much.